Yeah, one of the biggest mistakes is that people take the corner kick too close to the goalkeeper. So the goalkeeper can easily grab the ball. Hey FIFA fans, we've seen that many players struggle with scoring corners. We thought of solutions that will help you with finding the net more often, such as short corner, simple but effective corner, planned corner, or instructed corner. All these solutions will be explained in detail so you can understand and spice up your corner game. Let's talk about the commonly made mistakes when taking corner kicks. Danny, what mistakes do you see most commonly when people are taking corners? Yeah, one of the biggest mistakes is that people take the corner kick too close to the goalkeeper, so the goalkeeper can easily grab the ball. Does that mean I need to aim the ball further away from goal when taking a corner? Yes, you need to aim the ball further, but not too far, because otherwise it has no point. Even if you win the header, it's not dangerous at all. I see. Another thing for me is I like to play the ball short, but after I play the ball short, I don't know what to do with it. Yeah, it's really hard. I think when you don't have a plan for the short corner kicks, it's not working. When you just pass the ball blind and try to score, I don't think it's good, like shown here. We've talked a bit about the problems and mistakes that people make when taking a corner kick. Now, let's talk solutions. Danny, you told me earlier that passing the ball short from a corner kick is a good option. Can you tell me a bit more about that? Yes, when you're taking the ball short, you need to have a plan, and we have one for you. When you call a player short, there will be a player standing at the edge of the box. Sometimes people will man mark him, then you can use one of the other solutions that we explain later in this video. But when he isn't marking the player on the edge of the box, you can freely pass to him and choose further actions. With this solution, you need to have some vision and creativity. Now, you also have the possibility to use instructions with corners. What instructions do you use? But to surprise your opponents with the corner kicks, you can easily use the instruction tab. To let your players run to the front post, use arrow down and arrow down, or use one of the other tactics as you can see on the left bottom of the screen. Okay, you've given us some options for that, but what about just taking a corner? This one looks very basic, but many people forget this. Just whip the corner onto your tall player in the box, because when the keeper isn't moved, you still have a big chance of scoring it. Don't give it too much power though, around 3 bars is perfect. Danny, you've given us a lot of tips already. Do you have any special ones for corners? Yes, this solution is a special one, but it requires some practice. Take the corner with a player that can cut the corner inwards. Then use the L1 or LB button to select a highlighted player, then put the mark on top of the box, like in the video, and put 3 by power. Run to the marker with the highlighted player, cross the ball, aim towards the running player in the box, tap X or A to head the ball to him, and hopefully you get a good opportunity. When you master these tips that we gave you, you can surprise your opponents and maybe score that 90th minute goal. You can also try practicing this with a friend, which will make it much easier. 